the NIH, the National Cancer Institute, the American Institute of Cancer Research, and even the American Heart Association have, shown, have said that soy is safe. We really need to educate the public, uh, the doctors and the medical establishment in particular, about the safety of soy. There are numerous studies, including uh, the last, uh, there's the a couple of clinical studies that has recently been published uh, involving at least 5,000 subjects showing that uh, soy is safe, especially for breast cancer. In fact, it was protective against breast cancer. And um, a lot of the myth associated with the effect of soy and, and breast cancer, increase in breast cancer incidence is based on the work done in mice by this professor at University of Illinois called Dr. Halfridge in, in, in early 2000s. Even this professor, 10 years later, after looking at the data, shows uh, is now telling people that uh, he was wrong in trying to say that soy is bad for you based on the experiments in mice because when you look at the estrogen receptor in mice, it's different from the estrogen receptor in, in humans. So the effect of the soy phytoestrogens in mice, although it's promoting uh, uh, breast cancer cell growth in mice, is actually different from its effect in humans. In humans, it's actually protective, like this uh, uh, drug called tamoxifen, which is they, they, call, they consider it a, as a selective estrogen receptor modulator, which is the same mechanism as the phytoestrogens found in soy. That means it's protective against breast cancer. So this professor actually changed his tune. But the problem is people still looking at the data that's been done uh, 10 years or 12 years before, saying that uh, uh, soy can, can uh, promote breast cancer. But again, the NIH, the National Cancer Institute, the American Institute of Cancer Research, and even the American Heart Association have, shown, have, have said that soy is safe. Even um, uh, celebrity uh, uh, doctors were saying that soy is safe based on those human clinical trials, especially the last two human clinical trials done. And so if there's somebody, if a doctor or somebody in, in, in TV or in the internet saying that soy is not safe, what I would suggest for people is to uh, ask them for, for data to support their claims because really the, the recent human clinical data shows that soy is safe and it's protective against breast cancer.